What's going on guys, Chris back with you with another unboxing and review video. I got two, again, two of them right behind me and you're like, why do you have two? We're gonna get to that in just a second. But just like all my videos that I make, in the description box, you're gonna have the direct links for anything you see in the video. So stay tuned for that in the description box. All you guys in America, UK, India, and Canada, I got your guys' links in the description box. Anyway, let's get back into it. We have right here, ladies and gentlemen, the brand is S-B-O-D-E, and this is M400 multifunction Bluetooth speaker. So this is gonna be pretty much the same design as a UE Boom type of a speaker. Same functions, you know, you can make phone calls over it, you can connect it obviously Bluetooth to your smartphone, Android, iPhone, volume up, volume down. But what is most awesome about this is it's waterproof up to IPX6. Now that does not necessarily mean you can submerge it, but if it's in the rain for a pool barbecue and gets splashed on, you guys get the idea. It's waterproof up to IPX6. Just Google that if you want to find out exactly how waterproof that is. There is a built-in FM radio with auto searching. There's a card reader, multiple inputs, hands-free calling, rechargeable battery. The battery inside is 2200 milliamps, lithium ion battery provides up to eight hours of non-stop music play. And I believe IPX6 on the back of it here, it says water resistant, so like rainproof, you guys get the idea. Again, probably don't want to submerge it. True wireless stereo, and of course, Bluetooth. Dimensions are 2.72 inches across, 7.32 inches height. Output power is nine watts. Rated independence is four omega symbol. Rated voltage, DC five volt. It has a 3.5 millimeter AUX input, micro SD, FM radio, Bluetooth. The weight is 15.5 ounces. And the reason I have two of them is you can actually connect both of these right and left, and you can connect them to your TV, obviously, if you have a smart TV with Bluetooth connectivity. And then what you can do is you literally can have a surround sound left and right channel. We're gonna be rigging that up. True wireless stereo sync two speakers together for left and right channel, a richer and more surrounded sound. So this is gonna be like connecting two UE booms for a fraction of the cost. Again, in the description box will be the link for it. So let's go ahead and open them up, see what we got. So let's go ahead and crack this bad boy open here. Here we have the seal right here. I'm just gonna obviously unbox one because it's pretty much obviously the same thing in the other one. Save you guys the hassle of watching it all over again. Hey, very cool. Take a look at that bad boy right there, huh? As we can see the logo right on the top there, and then we have, again, nice little kind of a mesh material. That's like kind of, I guess, harder cloth type thing, plastic on the inside there. Again, same thing on the bottom, nice and soft here. So you can set it down both on both sides. Doesn't matter what side you set it down on, on your desk, it won't scratch it there. And then we have our buttons here. We have the power button up top here, Bluetooth phone call button there, uh, pause and play. Volume up, volume down, activity there, and then it looks like a battery uh, mode there. So let's go ahead and fire it up real quick. Power on, Bluetooth mode. Sweet, power on, Bluetooth mode, looking okay. fantastic. We have four little dots right here, we're looking good. So let's go ahead and rig up our phone. And also, of course, look at that little bad boy. You can have a little strap, you know, wrist strap or whatever you want to do. You can take that off if you want to. I'm going to go ahead and just remove that for right now. It's almost like a almost like a shoestring type thing, you know, a little wrist strap if you want to. But before we do connect it, let's go ahead and look what else is in the box. Underneath this little guy here, we have what looks to be an instruction manual or a little common card instruction manual. We have our AUX cable here. And then we have our micro USB charging cable. It doesn't come with a wall plug, but obviously you have that one for your phone or you can just plug it into your computer, charge it via computer, but it does not come with the wall socket portion, but just use your phone. And real quickly underneath this little flap here, we have our charging uh, micro USB input here. We have our AUX right there, our card reader right there. And then you go ahead and just kind of latch that on down there as we can see there. Sweet, let's go ahead and pair them on up. Okay guys, so I have it paired up to my iPhone. I went in the settings, obviously. You can do this with Android, of course. This is not an NFC symbol. You push this, and then what it does is it connects to both speakers. Blue, I believe, is left, obviously. Orange is right. I'm not exactly sure on that. You might have to alter them if this one is left or vice versa. Just look in your instruction manual, all that fun stuff. So I'm gonna go ahead and play some Pandora music. We're gonna play something with some vocals, something with a little bit of beat. So I can't play too much, obviously, because of copyrights on music, but I'll play some snippets so you guys can kind of get the idea of what we got. So let's go ahead and fire that up. That's awesome. 
awesome guys we're literally playing both of the speakers that is so sweet let's go ahead and play something with a little bit of bass now and see what we got let's play a little like um, kind of electronic music here They sound absolutely fantastic. I actually own a UE Boom. Let me show you real quick. Ladies and gentlemen, that sounds absolutely phenomenal. I literally have, I've used the UE Boom, of course, during like vacuuming when I'm cleaning the house and stuff like that. The only difference is pretty much not too much at all. It's pretty much very, very similar. And this one absolutely has some fantastic functions to them. Real quickly before I want to let you go guys, we're actually in Bluetooth mode right now. This is how we switch over to FM mode. The power button, one quick tap. FM radio mode. Nelson Frank. And then you use the plus and minus symbols. Just go ahead and tap it to get to your next station. Really As we can see there. Now volume, if you want to change the volume, long holds. Continuously hold it down and it will go up. Continuously hold down the negative button for it to go down and then of course push a very rapid button I think I shut it down completely there. There we go And then again, you just go ahead and scroll through the different channels there very cool guys And then for AUX mode just one more short tap It'll go into AUX mode plug in your cable play your music directly off of whatever device you have if you don't want to stream it Bluetooth and I'm just really really digging the sound quality of course pair it up right there to your left and right and get your hands on them below. Very impressive, guys. You guys have a wonderful evening and take care and I'll see you guys on the next review. My name's Chris, goodbye.